I think that uh, we've all found a new love for our past, you know, like I used to hate playing the song Tiger in a Dress, for example, I always thought it was the most embarrassing song I'd ever written. Um, and it probably still is, still is. But I've learned to realize that, you know, the past is our past, it is our foundation of where we came from. And so no matter how many times we have to play Rainbow Child or Stronger Than Steel or whatever, that um, we try to play it like it's the first time we played it. So it's always fresh in our mind. We enjoy it. We don't sit there and go, oh, God damn, we got to do this again. Um, we never get into that frame of mind, whereas we used to get in that frame of mind when we were in our late 20s. Right. We used to go, God, we have to play this again, you know, bitch and moan about shit. We got to open for the Stones tonight and play Tiger <laughs> Address. What the hell's going on? You know, that ego. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, so now it's like, we just feel tremendously fortunate that we get to still play music. So the old songs we love playing. Um, the thing with the new songs of this new album, this is the reason why we're so uh, focused on getting new videos out and getting them out early and that people get to hear the new music. So it's not just some kind of boring new song that people are hearing for the first time at shows, that they actually have heard it quite a bit and they love the new music. So that's kind of, we'll probably play four or five new songs out of a 15 song set. Mm. So I think that's the, the fine balance point there, spread it out over the set. 